Ladies and gentlemen, cabin crew, please remain seated. Looks like we got a ways before we break through this thing. We're gonna have some rough air coming up. We're gonna leave the seatbelt signs on for the time being. So just sit back, relax, and we hope to see Center Your Skies here in a bit. Hope to punch through the storm shortly. And again, please remain seated. Keep those seat belts fastened. Everyone, thank you so much for your patience. Uh, we'll restart beverage service once we reach clearer skies. Can you check the ATIS? I want to get a read on the weather report, see when we might break through this thing. Why doesn't your dad smile in photos? He never has. Yeah, but, but why? Uh, I don't know. Just not his thing. Even in my baby photos, he would just like hold me and just be like, probably something I did. As a baby? <sighs> hey, mom looks happy. Did they hate me? They hated me. They did not hate you. That's just how they are. Oh, you're just saying that? No, no. See, I love you. And because I love you, they love you too. And even if they hate your guts, they're still 2,600 miles away. <laughs> well, Raisinette loved me. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, it was fun. Yeah? Yeah, this shit going on in my brain doesn't matter. Thank you for asking me to come. It was perfect. Yeah. And thank you for smiling. Yeah, my pleasure. <laughs> Anything? No change. Looks like it's unavoidable. Projections are all over the place. Precipitation patterns are screaming MCC, but that can't be right. Great. Looks like this thing is following us. Turn. <laughs> uh, yes, sir, what can I do for you? Can you please tell the pilot to not crash the plane? Thanks. I assure you that he's already considered that. Are you on the same flight as me? I can I get you something? <sighs> my, my medicine, it's my back. Uh, uh, sure, is it in your carry-on? Do you know which bin? No, 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 my suitcase. Oh, sir, if you checked your luggage at the airport, we can't get to it. It's in cargo. No, 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 no. Don't, don't you have access to that? I mean, hey, what if it's an emergency? Uh, sir, I, I'm sorry. I, I can get you a headset or a pillow, blanket. I, I can get you some water. How can I relax knowing that we could crash any minute now? Heartbreaker. How old is she? Almost four. Oh, what a great age. I wish I could see the look on her face when she sees you. I'd be happy to see any look on her face. I've been overseas deployed for 24 months now. Only thing I could think about was her and her mom. Are you a soldier? Yes, ma'am. Army Ranger. So how much more time do you have left? Well, I was delayed in Paris. The only flight out was to LAX, so we got five hours to New York and then in our car ride, and I get to see my family. You're adorable. <laughs> <laughs> She's adorable. Oh, I'll say. They're getting restless. <laughs> yeah, well, hopefully we break through this before they get restless, restless. Well, we're about to start service, so anyone need anything now, though? Oh, uh, yeah, can you pass me one of the blankets, please? Yes. Here you go. You're too nice for this crew. Thank you, Liam.
I'm lying. I was worried. Name's Thaddeus. U.S. Air Marshal. Anna, nice to meet you. Flight deck. Oh, uh, can I get you guys anything? No, I think we're good. Thanks, Alice. Everything good back there? Uh, mostly. We had one passenger ask that you guys not crash the plane. Hadn't thought of that. Um, all right, well, uh, let me know if you guys need something. Just ring. We will. Thanks. Everything all right back there? Yeah, yeah. Seems good. Alice is just checking in. It would have been nice if JFK gave us a heads up on this storm before takeoff. Nah, I don't think they knew about it. I've never seen a storm this big creep up out of nowhere. We should have been able to eyeball this thing the moment we were off the ground. Yeah, these domestic red eyes are a nightmare, too. I mean, I've done my fair share, but after a while, I start, see, you know, needing some daylight. Any tips? All the coffee in the world, my friend. All the coffee in the world. Any plans for New York? Absolutely. Had a hot date. <laughs> the most beautiful woman you've ever seen. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. What's her name? Don't know yet. Blanket make things better? Maybe. I don't get people who are afraid of flying. Like, if you can't do it, why try? I don't think it's the flying. I think it's the being stuck in a compressed metal tube that resembles a penis while thinking about falling and exploding. <laughs> That's not an image I want to think of. What, a giant penis or the falling and exploding? Both. Were you ever afraid of planes? <laughs> I'm afraid of a lot of things, but flying isn't one of them. Being up here? It's a beautiful thing we do. And look at us, up here in the darkness where no one can see us. Still majestic birds after all this time. <laughs> How long has it been? Like three years, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Please, I'm, I'm busy. I, I'll get the next one. It's just. I'm sorry, you can't use the bathroom. The captain has to turn on the seatbelt. Like, Sir, don't close the door. Everything's fine. Everyone, everything's fine. Excuse me? What's happening? Uh, uh, it's, it's just nerves that happens. Uh, the storm has everyone shaken up. Literally, I take this flight all the time. This is the worst I've seen it. Do you live in Los Angeles? Oh, well, my parents do. We were just there on vacation. Um, we're heading back to New York, Brooklyn. 
Actually, it was a late honeymoon, really. Oh, well, congratulations. Thanks. Uh, let me ask you something. So what happens when a passenger is more out of control, like more than that? Um, uh, generally, these situations resolve themselves, but um, we have protocols in place for extreme situations. Yeah, man, that's scary. As I said, these situations usually resolve themselves. Nothing to fear. Oh, it's just the storm! It's just the storm! You've seen things! It's just the rain and the turbulence. <sighs> Sir, please calm down. I can't be on this sir, plane. Oh, sir. get me off this plane. Uh, she tried to grab me. Didn't you try to grab her? A woman. A woman in the mirror. A woman in the mirror. Please. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. Uh, need help? No. I'm an air marshal. Everything's fine. Back in your seat. Everyone back in your seat, please. I didn't. I, don't know. I think he's having a problem. I'm not having a problem. Stop. 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 I saw something. No. I saw something in the mirror. I'm about to restrain this passenger till we get the JFK. Do you have anything to calm him down? Uh, yes, but we've never given Whatever it to Whatever it is, grab it now. Okay. Grab it now. Grab it now. Yes. Hey, are you sure you guys don't need any help? No, everything's fine, okay? I'm a U.S. Air Marshal. Back in your seat. Everyone back in your seat. Oh, my God, he's a terrorist. No, I'm just dealing with somebody who's a little detached from reality right now. Oh. Miss! I really need you to hurry! I can hear you people! But I'm not a terrorist! How oh, am I a terrorist? I'm just not making this up. You have to leave them. There we go. Swallow. Swallow. Swallow it, swallow it. Shh, shh. Oh, that's what we want right there, okay? We're okay. Now we're good. Now we're gone. Now we're gone. Are you tying him up? You gotta keep him under control. We still have a lot of time left on this plane. Mm -hmm. I don't want him waking up and freaking out, okay? Okay. okay. I'm gonna get him up right now. Okay. Come on, come on, Okay. Everybody, in first class, I need you to get up and move to the back of the plane right now, please. Okay. Everyone out, come so on. Sorry, so sorry, back everyone. Of the plane. Okay, good. Ma'am, yes, uh, ladies, you too. Thank you so much. Okay, go ahead, sweetheart. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm so sorry. Uh, the passenger that was giving us the issues is trained. He's been medicated. Thank you so much for your patience with us. I think that uh, the flight should return to you all now. I'll get it. I'm That's what we want. Okay. That's what we want right there. Everything's okay. Interfere and stuff like this, Bran. What? Uh, I just wanted to help. Yeah, I know, but this isn't something you should be involved in. Okay, I'm sorry. I guess, I guess I'm still in my head about my parents. I don't know what the problem is. You said it was okay. I believe you. I always believe you. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe next time it'll be better. Oh, yeah, I hope so. Blanketing everything. Five minutes ago, looked like we'd be out of it in 20, but at least the altimeter and fuel gauge are working. Mm -hmm. 
lightly screwing with us? Yeah, it looks like it, but I shouldn't be doing all this at once. Flight deck. Captain, it's Liam. Uh, the storm caused a passenger to freak out. Uh, the marshal stepped in and assisted, but we had to sedate and restrain him. Restrain him? Is everything under control back there? I, I think so. Okay, good. Just make sure everybody's comfortable. Storm's the only thing I want to worry about right now. Got it. Just a water, please. Okay. Uh, miss? I was wondering if you had anything else I could snack on. I mean, I, I had the peanuts, and, and this gentleman uh, gave me his, but my stomach is still rumbling. Oh, um, we're gonna start the in-flight meal as soon as the storm dies down. Okay, but is there anything you can do? <laughs> if I get you one of the prepackaged salads, would that help? for sharing your peanuts. Of course. <laughs> you think he saw a ghost? No. I mean, I think he probably thought he saw one. But come on. Yeah. Probably just crazy. You know, I think I saw ghosts when I was little. Really? I mean, maybe. <laughs> when you see things you don't understand, like walking down an old hallway, and you see someone out of the corner of your eye, but you look and they're gone. Or you're driving and there's someone behind you. You look for them and then they're just gone. Is that ghosts or just other people? OK, like this one time, I remember being in my bed at night, lying on my side, looking out my window at this line of trees that's behind my house. And I was blinking a lot, because I was trying to go to sleep. And there's this guy that walks out of the woods. A guy? He looks like Frankenstein. But that's probably not right. <laughs> <laughs> he started walking awesome. towards the house, through the backyard straight towards my window until I could see the whites of his eyes. And then he just stood there and looked at me. Oh, shit. What did, what did you do? I freaked out. I ran to my parents' room, woke them up, told them I saw a guy in my window. And then my dad, he came in and looked around, but there was nobody there. They even went into the backyard. They said I was dreaming. Well, were you dreaming, though, you think? I don't remember falling asleep or waking up. I mean, I don't, I don't think you saw ghosts, babe. I think you saw creeps. I don't know. Have you ever seen one? No. Okay, you know that's not gonna get you out of my happy wedding conversation, okay, right? All right, worth the try. Yeah, worth I know. the try. Cool it.
You know, if you give someone a salad during a storm, we'll be picking crouton crumblies off the floor for hours. I know, she was very cute. So this has been a flight, huh? I know. God, I hope it's the worst that'll happen. Well, we've got Charles Bronson over there keeping watch. We should be fine. Are you okay? Okay, all right. Need some help over here. Oh, my God. Oh, are you all right? Oh, no. Give me like a towel. Yeah. Now it's anything. Okay. Okay, can you breathe? All right. She's coming back. All right. Oh, let's just keep going. Okay. All right. Here you go. Let's get you back to your seat. There you go. Get up. Easy, easy. I think it's in my hair. Check the other salads. Go. Sorry to bother you again. US 57, be advised. You're rapidly approaching a low pressure system. It'll be difficult to continue tracking you. This is Pan US 57. Over. We're losing you. Pan US 57, over. Pan US 57, be advised. Pushing a low pressure system. To continue tracking you. Speed now. Liam, what's going on? Our in flight meals are. Well, they're rotten, I think. Rotten. They're like satanic rotten. Full of maggots. Actual maggots. That's disgusting. The inflate meals are rotten. Great. Have Liam call LAX, tell him about the food. Captain says to call LAX. Let them know about the food. Just, there's not much we can do from up here. So just try and keep the passengers as comfortable as you can, and worst case, we'll take care of them when we land. What did he say? You keep everyone comfortable. <sighs> Phones aren't working. We're running out of ways to keep them comfortable. Seriously, bring on the frogs. What? What else was there? Locus? Darkness? Yeah. Bring on the... <laughs> No power to the engines. This gotta be a technical bug. No way we got struck. No thrust. Altimeter's out. All right, we might have to keep the nose up in this glide. You got eyes on the horizon, Ryan? I, I, I'm trying. I can't tell it's down right now. All right, keep your eyes out there. Wait for a lightning strike. Mayday, 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 JFK Center, this is Pan US 57. We've got dual engine failure on repeat, all engines out, going for engine failure systems check. Ryan, anything? No. Come on! We're in aerodynamic stall. We are dead stick. We've got to get the APU fired up, or we are up at Shit's Creek. Yeah. Auxiliary's not working. Shit! Yeah. Up. Copy that. Pull back with me. We gotta get this nose level. Let's go. Come on! Come on! Get them spinning, the generators will run. 
What about the rat? No, we're too far out. Not gonna work. Fire, damn it, connect! Please contact the cockpit, thank you. Good work. I've never seen a plane die like that before. I have. But not like that. Whew. Looks like you're getting to see a lot of things you've never seen before tonight. Whew. Jesus Christ, I think I almost had a heart attack. <laughs> Can you start the walkthrough? Back there. Oh. Uh, uh, yeah. How are we doing over here? Yeah, I think so. Uh, that was a lot. How about everyone else? Any injuries? Uh, I don't. I don't know. I haven't started the walkthrough yet. Copy that. Looks like we're about 4:10 till we hit New York. Just try to keep everyone calm and comfortable, and let's see if we can make this a better trip from here on out. Last thing we need is a plane full of angry people. Okay, Jay, thank you so much. Yes. Oh, sweetie, that looks bad. Oh, my God. You know, why don't we touch you up in the restroom? I'm not qualified for this. Thanks. I need to... Yes, sir, thank you. They're doing everything they can. Ladies and gentlemen, apologies for the turbulence. As you may have gathered, our aircraft experienced a brief loss of power, which caused the drop in altitude. But everything's back in order. The good news is planes are made to handle situations like this. We hit a rough patch of sky, but it's our number one priority to get you to New York or wherever your final destination may be with us this evening, safe and sound. Hoping to have you on the ground in just about four hours. So just sit back and try to relax. We'll be sending the flight crew through the cabin to make sure everyone's okay. And once again, we apologize for the discomfort. On behalf of the airline and the crew, we hope you enjoy the remainder of the flight. Why am I? It's just a zip tie, okay? A zip tie? What are you? Not? You had an episode. I had to restrain you. Oh, I'm saying it's for your own good. But no, no, you don't understand. Okay, I'm gonna tell you one time, one more time. Shh. Listen to me. You have the right to remain silent. And if I were you, that's exactly what I would do.
Chase Center, Pan US 57. LAX Center, Pan US 57. We've lost contact with JFK. Do you copy? Shit. I can't get anyone. I, they were updating us on the pressure systems. This all happened after we lost power. Keep trying, they'll come back. What about the systems check? Well, if it, if it ran through the book, the plane can fly, but after the outage, uh, we've got a few problems. According to the diagnostics, the cabin pressure is good, fuel's good. Landing gear. Landing gear is out. Comms are down and autopilot's gone? Yeah. Okay, well, this plane may not be brand new, but it's one of the greatest ever built. Keep our hands on the wheel, we should be just fine. What about FMS? What happens if for some reason we lose navigation? You've never flown one of these things before, have you? Through a storm with engine failure? Not really. <sighs> Keep calm, kid, all right? I've been through worse than this. Keep your head on. What's Ada saying about the weather report? Um, well, we're still surrounded. Um, even if we wanted to divert our path, according to the data, there's no way around it, and we're stuck in the middle. I can't see anything out there. Look, equipment, no equipment, radio or no radio, Storms only last so long. We'll be through this shortly. Your head. Keep it on. Do my best. I can't open the door from this side. Help me! Ma'am? Can, can you let me know that you're okay, please? I can't get out! Hello! Someone's coming to help, okay? Please just stay calm. If you can hear me, stay calm. What's up? Um, I, th I think that there's a woman trapped inside. She's stuck. Uh, but, yeah, um, the locking mechanism isn't working properly. All right, here, let me try. Okay. This is the U.S. Air Marshal. I need you to open this door right now. You're right. The lock override switch seems to be jammed. I need something to pry open the door with. Uh, OK. 
Okay, we have run. Stand up for me. Seriously. We're never flying this flight again is what's going on. No, I'm serious, man. Okay, that guy freaks out. There's maggots in the food. Hey. No, no. Hey. People are throwing up. The lights are going out on the plane. Okay. Hey. People are getting hurt. Hey. And that poor woman, I don't I, know. I don't know what's going I know, on. No, I know. I don't I don't know either. We're in a hell of hey, we're in a hell of a storm. Okay? And storms pass. All right? Are you okay? I thought we were gonna die. You're not gonna die. The the air marshal said that the Crazy one was a terrorist. Okay, okay, ma'am, ma'am. He didn't say that. I think he actually said the opposite. Hey, what are we supposed to do when there's a crazy person on the plane? I mean, what if he hurts somebody? Okay, well, maybe we shouldn't call him crazy. Yeah. And what's this talk about ghosts? Okay, nothing. All right. It's, okay. it's just. We're just all a little frazzled right now. It's a malfunction. It's a malfunction with the plane. That's it. Look, all I know is you better keep that man away from me because I just want to get on the ground. You know, maybe, maybe we got struck by lightning, you know? I mean, that explains the power going in and out. Lightning hits planes in the air all the time. What are you, a mechanic? Well, I'm a teacher and I watch the news. Okay, you know what, cool it, all right? We're in a storm, okay? We're on a plane, the plane is a machine. If you so much as use your cell phone, the signals get jumbled, all right? So if we're this high up, we're covered by clouds, surrounded by lightning, of course, some shit's gonna go wrong. So please, stop making accusations that you guys don't even know it's true. You're gonna make everyone panic. Exactly. Everyone just take a deep breath, sit back, and try to relax. Are you sure everything's normal? No, I'm not sure. But it's not supernatural. We're on a plane, and, and planes have problems. <laughs> Something's not right, Brent. I know. Look, how about we take our mind off this? Like music, maybe? You, you still haven't listened to the mixtape that my brother put on your phone in L.A.? Yeah, right? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. It feels weird. Okay, okay, okay. Babe, 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 babe. We're in a storm. Storms pass. Okay? Mm -hmm. Now, if I open my carry-on and snakes fall out, <laughs> I'll be the first to let you know, okay? <laughs> okay. Okay. Did you 
say something to me? What? I, um, thought I heard something. Hear that? Hear what? There's someone trying to to call me or speak to me or something. What? What am I trying to hear? I don't hear anything. Brandon. What? <sighs> Nothing. There's procedure for a reason. You can't just barge in here like that. Look, three hours and some change will be on the ground. That's what I'm worried about. That's what we're all worried about. <sighs> we're losing this flight. I need you to take control now. Sorry? So far, we've had a lightning storm, rotten food people having panic attacks, and then losing power. I don't know what this is, but it isn't normal. She's got a point. Alice, I need you to calm down, okay? It's a rough flight, but you've been doing this long enough. You should know. All right, I don't know what's going on back there. I have no idea what the problem is, but I can't be back there to fix it personally. I'm doing everything I can to keep us in the air. Yes, sir. I... No, I know you're trying, and you're doing a great job. It's just we're doing all we can up here. Sorry, Alice. Yes, sir. I understand. Trying to be a hard ass here. It's just we can all make it through this flight without losing our minds. Drinks are on me. You see in this? See what? What is that? They're in the clouds. Oh, those birds? Uh, that's impossible. Birds don't fly at this altitude. Well, then what in the world? What are those people? What are you talking about, Captain? I, I don't see anything. You're not seeing this? Right here, right, right. I swear to Christ. People? Uh, you want me to take over for a minute? Maybe, uh, you know, I think a break might do you some good, maybe some coffee or something. A break? No, I don't need a break. Shit. A bottle of water, please, Alice. Exhausted. It's a red eye direct coast to coast, and we're flying in. I know. I just I'm scared. Yeah, me too. Yeah, maybe a little. I don't know. Something's not right. Something just doesn't feel right. Your hands have been shaking. 
are they? I didn't even notice. I, I guess I just get a lot on my mind. Sure this stays open, okay? Danny. I don't feel well. What's going on? Would you think it was weird if I thought there was something else on this flight? Is it like your Frankenstein thing? No. I'm not following. Danny. Danny? Honey, hey, Danny. Are you OK? Do you have aspirin? Uh, yeah. I think there's something in my carry-on. Get away from me! Get 
Get water away from you. There's this. There's nothing there. There's nothing. Baby, look. There's nothing there. Look at me. Look. 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 There's nothing there, baby. Hey! How about you two quit freaking everybody out? We're not trying to freak anybody out. Guys, keep your voices down, right? This is not making it better. In fact, it's making it worse. This is some bullshit. Sir, I'm just Please. trying to calm her down. Better? What did you see? A woman, I think. She was dead in the bed and stuffed in there. I opened it and she grabbed me. And, and I know there's nothing there, but it looked and it felt so real. I believe you. You do? Yeah. Something's going on here. We just need to find out what. Sure. Uh, yeah, I think so. I'm fine. I promise. I just don't know what's going on. All right, I'm done. Look, excuse me, I'm gonna go to the bathroom, all right? You really don't want to go to the bathroom. Oh, great, Mr. Crazy Man's awake. Look, please don't say it, okay? There are no terrorists on this plane. Look, Mr. Marshall, come here. Why don't we just tie her ass to a chair? Well, that should be the best way to tie her Whoa, whoa, whoa. Down. No one's gonna get tied down to anything, okay? You can keep her calm. You got nothing to worry about. I just, I just don't understand, okay? I don't understand what's going on. I don't understand what's going on with my wife. Look, nobody knows what's going on. But the one thing that I do know is that I trust the man with the badge. And the gun? Look, there's a lot of crazy, unseen shit going on in here. And I don't know what it is, but I do know that this woman here... Hey, 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 enough! Easy, enough! Listen to me. We are just trying to get back to our families, just like everybody in this place. Get you in your seat. Let me get you in your seat. Hey, wait, wait, no, no, I said in your seat, now! Sit down, hey, in your seat, now! Now listen up! I need everyone to keep their head on their shoulders. Let's stay calm, okay? Now, I don't think it's terrorism. So let's stop using that word. That word just gets everyone worked up. Yeah, but I... Don't! What... Whoa, 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 what are we in North Korea now? We can't express ourselves. <laughs> really? Are you serious? Look, look, I'm sorry. I'm not usually this much of an asshole. I just want to get on the ground. Guys, hey, hey! Look, it's scary when the plane malfunctions. It is. But we are people who do this for a living. So let us do our job and we will be fine. See, it's exactly what I was saying, a malfunction. So what are we talking about here? Gas leak, loss of cabin pressure? No, I didn't say that. How much longer until we get to New York? Are we gonna be okay? It's just gonna be a couple <laughs> more hours, okay? We're almost there. Miss? Captain, make sure all the mechanical issues are in order, please. What do you think is going on here? We are losing electricity. Often. It's a good place to start. I'm no mechanic. And I'm sure the captain's doing everything he's supposed to be doing on his end. Most important thing is, we're still in the air. We got that going for us. Fantastic, fantastic. Finally, somebody that knows what the hell they're doing. Hey, should... you keep talking like that, the two of us are gonna have a real serious problem. So I need you to sit here and keep your mouth shut. You got that? Yeah. I'm so sorry about all this. Hey, hey, hey. Don't be sorry, okay? You didn't do anything wrong. I don't know what's happening. Did you take the aspirin? Of course, but if I wouldn't... Don't, don't worry, sweetheart. You all do realize that if there is a major malfunction while we're in the air during a storm, that's worse than ghosts, right? Because that can actually kill us. Okay, the plane is not haunted. That's an insane theory. Why don't we just land the plane and check for problems on the ground? Look, has the captain mentioned anything about when and where we're gonna land? From what I can tell, you know, the storm's are making it hard to get anywhere. I mean, at this point, trying to land in this. We're safer up here. Excuse me? What about the storm? Do you have any idea when it'll be behind us? No, I mean, at the moment, the storm's been getting everything, and it seems to be tracking with us. Excuse me! What do you want? It's not electrical. <laughs>
it's real. What's real? Look, we can't land until the storm clears up, Alice. You know that. We need to land it now, Jack. Alice, what's going on? It's going to the plane is haunted. Again with this? Ryan? Look, we're, we're all tired. No, 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 no. You need to listen to me, Ida. You don't know. We just saw this lady down in the aisle, and you're the only ones that didn't see it. You should maybe sit down for just a little bit, okay? I'm getting worried about you. We're going to be on the ground in like 95 minutes. No, listen! No! The, the longer that we're up here, the longer we put the lives of everybody up here in jeopardy. Yeah? And where do you want me to land, Alice, huh? Our comms are out. The storm's been on us since takeoff. We're on our own with nowhere to go. The plane's haunted. Would you listen to yourself? We're not going to land the plane because you're superstitious. I mean, why would ghosts want to haunt this plane? Oh, Excuse me? What did you say? Revenge! Ryan, leave your belt on. Ryan. Ryan. just saw, but something's definitely wrong. We agree on that, right? I mean, you said there's something physically wrong with the plane, right? No, not, not anything that's going to cause hallucinations or visions. I don't know what would cause us to see the things we saw. OK, well, let's start from the beginning. Uh, so the storm started soon after uh, takeoff. Um, Pre-check was fine. Luggage was fine. Uh, Mr. Peck in 25A. He, yeah, poor guy. Yeah. And Mr. Peck, he claimed that he saw something unusual on the wing of the plane. And uh, then he went to the bathroom to cool off, and then he got spooked again. Well, I know what I saw in the bathroom was real. The woman in the bathroom, she was in the mirror, and she was reaching out for me. And then I fell through the floor. I, I couldn't get the door unlocked. Yeah, me either. I tried, but it, I couldn't. It, it, it felt like it was being held from the inside. But I checked it, though. I mean, there's nothing physically unusual about it. OK, then the plane lost power, and we fell. And then the food was spoiled somehow. I heard a woman scream through my earbuds. Scream? Scream what? Uh, at first, it was whispers. Then it got louder. It sounded like she said, murder. Well, and that's when my phone stopped working. Mine too. I thought I was the only one. 
and there was something really weird on my screen. What was it? A sonogram. A what? You know, like, when you take pictures of babies from a pregnant lady? That woman in the aisle. And then Ryan going crazy and attacking Jack. And then the corpse on the bilber had been. And uh, now someone's written murder on the outside of your window. So, what are we looking for, and where do we even start? Okay, I mean, it has to be coming from around here somewhere. Well, it all started in the front of the plane. Well, but I already checked the bathroom, though. And we've been up there most of the flight. Well, that wouldn't explain the phones or the overhead bins. Or what happened in the cockpit. We are so screwed. No, no, we're not screwed, guys. Okay, listen. We just need to find the source to what the hell is going on right now. Well, Ryan. <laughs> Where am I? Give me my hands. That's on purpose, kid. What happened? You attacked Jack. What? You got crazy eyes and went straight for the throat. <laughs> you know what? Why would I do that? All right, listen up. I know it's been a crazy night for all of us, but there has to be a perfectly reasonable explanation for all of us. There are only so many places to look. If not the cabin, the front or the back, what else is there? Okay, well, we decided that it started on the wing, and now we have that word written on his window. Yeah, but we can't check outside in the wing right now. We're in the middle of a flight. What about the manifest? Is there anything on board that's out of the ordinary? Nothing that I know of. No special packages from museums, no dead soldiers being transferred home from Afghanistan. Brandon? What do you say? I mean, objects could be conduit for spirits, okay? Maybe there's something on the plane that's traveling with it. Okay, so if there's nothing on the manifest, what do we do? What were you saying? When? Um, when you said you fell through the floor, where did you go? Um, I don't know, the cargo hold, I think. Why? Because I saw that too. When I fell back against the seat, and then I was in the cargo hold. Babe. There was someone there, and I don't, I don't know, but I felt like they needed my help. Wait, what do you say? Bran, I, there's something, something happened. Something bad. We have to go down there. Babe. If we're having visions of the same thing in the same location, something is telling us to go down there. The luggage. Speak up. The luggage. I, I don't know what's going on, but talking about it isn't going to solve anything. Like she said, we need to go down there and see for ourselves. If I find out you have something to do with this, you are in a big world of hurt. Do you understand that? How? How? You tied me and put me in a chair. Cut him loose. Yeah. Cut him loose. Any one of us would have freaked out in that bathroom. <sighs> Miss, would you happen to have any scissors? Please. Yes, thank you. Don't make me regret this. You won't. Okay. Here's what's gonna happen next. You're all gonna go back to your seats, and I'm gonna go down to the cargo area and check I, it out. I'm for sorry, myself. sorry, guys. Uh, no one can go down to cargo. Do you want this to come to an end or not? Because I gotta cover all my bases here. I'm going with you, Danny. No, you are not going with me. No. It was speaking to me. I saw it. I'm not gonna sit up here and wait for someone else to figure it out. I'm going. No, you're not going. Look, I'm going too. 
I didn't travel this far to get back to my wife and my kid to not get home now. Now, if getting down there and finding out what's going on is going to help us all get home, then I'm going to help you. I have your six men. I appreciate that, but I'm doing my job right now, and I'm going down alone. Danny, you stay here, and I'm going to go with the marshal. Nobody's coming no, with! please, stop! Just follow me. You guys are gonna have to be quick. You can't see anything down there. That light won't be strong enough. Thank you. That one will. There we go. What is that? This is a baby. Towards us and disappeared. Holy oh, Mary, Mother of God, that's there. Wait, wait. This bag belongs to someone on the plane? A, a killer? Wait, okay, whose bag is this? Well, that's easy to figure out. Respect, Marshal, but can we do this another time? I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm flying this plane by myself, and we haven't really been having a great night. Are you sure you want to do this right here? Do what? Talk about the women you've murdered. Murdered? <laughs> murdered? Are you serious? Cut the bullshit! You, whoa! You can't talk to me like that! Now look, Marshal, whatever you think's going on, I can't have this many people in the cockpit. I'm sure you know protocol. I'm afraid I'm not gonna be able to follow protocol right now, Captain. And neither are they. What is this? Look, we're almost on the ground. Whatever it is can wait till we're on the ground. No, can't wait. We're talking about this right now. Where did you get these? What did you do to her? I don't know what you're talking about, but... What is this? Good God, what's wrong with you people? I don't know who this woman is. Don't lie to me! What did you do to her? What did you do to her baby? It's funny how the women in these photographs are the same women causing all the problems on this plane tonight. Also very funny how all the pictures ended up in your bag. Jack. Captain, 
I don't... These aren't my... Oh, come on! Tell the truth! Captain! Everyone killed. Come on. Okay, come on. No. Not everyone. Just you. I 
I liked it. I loved it. I loved watching the inspiration and blink and then fade. It became an urge, a need. Then it became me. I, I realized I could just fly away and no one would know. I didn't know how to stop. I just... Oh, God. I'm so sorry. Please. I'm so sorry. I just... I don't know how to stop it. Please, give me. I'll do it.
It's okay. It's okay. 